Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. I am super pleased that you are joining me again today. We're back here in Summerlin, Las Vegas. We're featuring a single story here at my back. And this is the community of Linar here at Stonebridge Heritage, right? So this is a very nice location, guys, because it's only going to take you about 25 minute drive to the Las Vegas Strip. In addition, you have easy commute access to the downtown Summerlin. And what's special about this home is that, first of all, you have a lot of stonework in front of the house. Second of all, you have three car garage. Third of all, your third garage actually has access to the casita. Yes, this house will have a casita. It's moving ready. It's ready to go. You just have to bring your toothbrush and don't forget your favorite toothpaste. And you're ready to live the life of a Las Vegas local. Today is quite nice weather. It actually rained yesterday. so. The weather is pretty nice. Uh, if you read in the news, it's actually very unknown for this month to be like this. Because usually last year, I, I knew that it was hotter than this during the month of June. But right now, you can walk and I am on my suit. I don't feel hot only when it's like you're walking, of course, a long period of time. But if you're just hanging around like this, it's nothing. There is no hotness that I'm feeling right now. It's only the sun is up, right? But I wanted to showcase this because the reason why is some people are looking for homes single story with a casita. And then what's special on this home is that you have a casita ready to go with its own kitchenette without the stove, of course, but it has its own refrigerator, laundry area, living room, dining, and its own separate bedroom. So you can close that casita if you don't want your family members, guests, or any person you would want to stay on that casita. It also has its own garage, as I mentioned a while ago. And then what's special also on this home is that it is positioned in an elevated lot area of the community, which has views of the mountain. So you will have to enjoy those. It also has a lot of appliances already included. They've actually included the monogram appliances inside. So once we go to the inside of the house, you'll see the different elegant monogram appliances. And if you Google monogram, it's a very expensive one. So if they're including that, so that means it's already baked into the price. Now they also included the laundry machines. So that's amazing. Now, I wanted to invite you, if you haven't done so, please don't forget, like this video, and very, very important, if you comment down below, I'll be able to know and uh, appreciate it because I'll be able to figure out if this kind of home works for you or other homes that i featured so far on this channel. Don't forget to check out the channel page because in the channel page, you'll be able to see a lot of move-in ready homes if you would like to move in easily then please check out the move-in ready homes and if you don't find the home you like there i can definitely research for you if you just check out the screen that is where you can contact me you can call me text me whatever you want i'll be able to call you back or text you back now this one is also going to have a bonus footage of the community center so watch out the bonus footages because now we're including both the community tour of your particular community and also I have included as a standard for each video we're doing every day is that we're including the auto voice for the exact location of this community and the commute time from the Las Vegas Strip because a lot of you guys wanted to know how far or how near the location is from the different areas such as the fabulous Las Vegas Strip. We're also adding another bonus footage which will include the different shops, restaurants that you may find nearby the community or your home. So those are the different bonus footages we're including on this particular tour so that you'll be well informed about the home, the community and the shops around 
it will be fantastic so many information guys now I wanted to clarify the HO fees on the screen $355 which includes the use of the community pool, lots of pickleball courts, and also it includes the master plan fee because you're here in Summerlin, they have a master plan fee and they have that special improvement district fee which is called the SEED. So that is making the roads even better, the schools, uh, different developments is allocated for that fee. So that is what you're paying if you wanted to stay in the beautiful summer lane. Aside from that, Red Rock Mountain is just nearby. In fact, on the screen, you'll see the different um, things to do there. You can hike, bike, right? There's so much things to do there if you're into nature. And if you wanted to use the pool, definitely enjoy it. And the bonus footage you'll be able to see, you have access to the pool with amazing views, unobstructed views of this trip. And then you also have a high-end fitness center there and a lot of things to do so please check out all the bonus footages i can't wait for us to tour this together guys this is going to be a long video but let's do this let's tour this beautiful home together hi there before we begin the tour let me guide you on how to reach the stonebridge community from the bellagio fountain These are the amenities available in the Stonebridge community. Okay guys, this is another bonus footage. This is the entrance of your community here. Right? This is a very luxurious entrance. Okay, you have the mountain views there, the strip is somewhere there. But watch out for the bonus footage because I'm going to show you the um, community, right? So this is how it feels, guys, when you're entering your community here, right? You have a gate. It feels luxurious here. And it's in Summerlin. I can see the um, Red Rock Mountain there. So this is Heritage at Stone Bridge by Lenar. You have double gate there, double security, right? You have a, sorry, it's just one gate, but you have a, um, a security guard. If you're a resident, you have your own fab. But if you're not a resident, you definitely will need to go to the guard because they needed to check your ID. So that's how they protect the, uh, the uh, residents here. They have a guard. So I hope this gave you an idea of what you are getting in your community. And let's do the bonus footage for the community pool. Okay guys, this is a bonus footage. This is your clubhouse here. They have outdoor spa, swimming pool, fitness center. It's a 10,000 square feet clubhouse. So for those of you guys who wanted to enjoy life after um, a day's work or maybe if you're already retired, this is a very nice hangout place. This is huge and it feels like you're in uh, a different city here meaning it doesn't feel like you're in Vegas when you go here because it's huge and then you are surrounded with all of these mountain views so those that is the red rock already so this is gorgeous here you know if I only have the chance because my mother is not here in the US right but I would definitely buy one for my mom if she's here because she will enjoy this right she's gonna hang out here okay this is the clubhouse guys lots of parking free parking here right for all the residents and the guests so if you this is a 55 plus so that means you just have to um be 55 and above but your children above 19 will be able to um access this 
and live with you. So the clubhouse operation during the weekend is up to 6 p.m. So let's enter this clubhouse. So in this, you have a reception area here, right? And then on this side is their office. Okay, I can't, sorry. Hi, how are you doing? So this is their uh, clubhouse here, guys. So you will be able to access all of this, right? So they have this uh, kitchen here. This is a gorgeous kitchen you can use, guys, as part of, a, of the home office. So this is their uh, admin office. This looks like a ballroom area here. I have to ask if you can uh, rent this out for your parties, right? Hi there. So this is what you're getting when you buy a home here at Linar. Let's check first what's happening here. So you have a kitchenette area with some coffees, right? Wow, okay, free coffee. <laughs> so, and then you have the refrigerator there. Okay, this is gorgeous, guys. So you can hang out there and enjoy a beautiful life here in the fabulous Las Vegas. And then, let me show you what you're getting, right? So you have a gym. This is amazing. There's no one here. Why is no one working out? It's Sunday. But no one is working out. I have to make sure that people have to work out. Please enjoy this, right? It's all yours. Look at this, guys. No one is here. And then this is your swimming pool, right? There are two swimming pools. There's one um, spa there and there's another spa there. So they're going to pamper you with a beautiful life here. Now, this is what I like. Because when you're doing your... Um, treadmill you actually have a view of the fabulous Las Vegas strip and let me expand this guy so that you can see what I mean okay guys this is how it feels so when you're doing your treadmill you will be able to see the fabulous Las Vegas strip this is amazing okay okay guys so that's your uh, view right really nice they have all of the equipments here. Hello guys. So definitely enjoy this guys because this is definitely one of those where so you better have to use it, right? This is an example of the men's room. There's no one here. So I was, you know, I just wanted to give you an idea of how the restroom looks like. Hello guys. See how you have a lot of a very high end design here. You have lockers, right? No one is here, so they allowed me to film, right? Okay, really nice. You have a shower area there, right? This is a very high-end uh, uh, bathroom area. Of course, I'm just in the gentleman's, right? I can't feature the ladies. Okay, the ladies' bathroom, because uh, it's not allowed, of course. So I hope this gives you an idea of what you're getting at your bathroom area of the clubhouse. Now we're gonna go to the area of the swimming pool. Okay, so this is your swimming pool, guys. This is amazing. No one is here. Oh, there's only one actually. So imagine yourself enjoying the beautiful life of a fabulous Las Vegas local. So good here. The mountain views are there. Right, so you have a kitchen area there. So you can rent this out and make sure you serve it, right? If you wanted to use it. Right, you have a, uh, you have a barbecue area here. Hello guys, Hi. how are you doing? Do you love it here? Hi. You like it here? Yeah, I have clients that are buying here, so yeah, they, they love the view. Really nice. Uh, is it really nice? Yeah. Nice, nice. They like it here. When I saw, when I saw them, they are like, oh my gosh, they didn't know there's such a view like this. Yeah. Well, yeah. Uh, friends and family over here as 
Oh, nice, nice. Yeah, I'm Angelo. My YouTube channel is Angelo Home Tours. Yeah, so I feature homes all over Las Vegas. Yeah, I'm glad you're enjoying it. <laughs> have a good, have fun. Okay, so they are enjoying their uh, stay, meaning they own a home here, right? Oh my goodness, this is amazing. So we're gonna uh, take a look. A uh, this is like hanging out here. There's another pool there. Okay. So uh, I'm rushing because they're gonna. Um, I'm meeting a, an agent here to show me the quick move-ins, right? So that's the reason why I'm a little rushing right now. But this is what you will get, guys. They, uh, they can't stay with you if they are above 19 years old. Okay. Wow. There's a lot of... It almost feels like it's better than a... Uh, it's actually much better than a resort. Because this is massive, guys. You just can't feel it right now, but... Once you go here, you'll feel this is a massive area. You have another spa area here. Imagine yourself hanging out like this and then overlooking the fabulous Las Vegas Strip. Look at this, guys. I'm going to expand this to see, to show you how what it means. Hey, okay, guys, this is your view. For some reason, the sun is lighting up the entire Las Vegas Strip. Right? This is gorgeous. And we're in Summerlin. This is elevated. So there's a lot more homes to be built there. If I, I would highly suggest getting that lot, guys. Because you're backing um, at a space and then you're overlooking the entire strip. So if you wanted to know that lot, please call me so that we can schedule to tour that lot. Because I feel like you will have a view if you put your house somewhere there, right? So your backyard is facing this strip there. Okay, so if you only wanted to build because there's no house there. Okay, you have a mountain view here. Red Rock Mountain is here. Mount Charleston is nearby. So much things to do here, guys. Okay. Okay, so this, this is your view another span so that you can appreciate how near it is it's actually much nearer in appearance on when in person this video shows it's so small but when you go here in person you can literally see the strip right okay let's go back to the original setting okay guys so you are getting all of this So the couple a while ago I retired also. They are doing their swim. They are enjoying their life. That's how I would do it if I'm already too old uh, and I don't have to worry about anything else. I'm going to enjoy life and live like this, right? Where you can enjoy the space, very peaceful. There's another view here that you can uh, enjoy, right? See how this is entirely greenery here. Right? This is your clubhouse. That is the uh, pool area which we went to. And then this is the entire clubhouse here. So Red Rock is like crazy good. Okay, I'm going to expand this guy so you can see what it means. Now there's a beaver lots there that might have views of the mountains too, right? If you want to. So let me expand this again. Okay guys, this is the view. Red Rock Mountain is color red right now. Okay. Wow, this is fabulous. You know, it's hard to get this sometimes, this kind of view. But they're giving it already. It just makes your mind really relaxing when you're seeing this open space. Right? You see a lot of mountain views at your doorstep. Right. And this is again the, the view of this trip. Wow, this is amazing. Okay. I hope you enjoy this tour, guys, of your clubhouse because this is what you're getting for the monthly HOA fees that you're paying. And the good thing is not 
there's not a lot of people, so therefore, therefore you can really enjoy it. Okay, let's go back to the original setting. Okay, so let's go back. Let's go back to the. Uh, wow, this is natural grass, guys. This is going to be precious in the future <laughs> because everything is fake grass or artificial grass nowadays. So, so this is natural grass. And then you have a lot of seating arrangement here, right? Okay. So I couldn't go to the tennis area, but there is a tennis area that you said here, right? Wow, this is amazing. Oh, it's already closed. So, yeah, this one is the area where you can enter, but I feel like it's close. Yeah, it's already close. So we're gonna go on that side. Okay. Or maybe let's go on this side so you can see what's in here on this side. There's also some speakers to enjoy, right? It's so nice. Oh, so you can access the, uh, the site here too. Okay, so this is another area, guys, where you can enjoy the... Uh, is this a pickleball? I, I don't know if it's a pickleball. Yeah, there's another play area here. I believe this is a pickleball. This is not a tennis court, of course. It's so small. But this is one of those that you will get, guys. Oh, there's another area there. Okay, we're gonna go there. I wonder what is, oh yeah, this might be a pickleball then. I don't know, it's hard to tell. Okay, because I've never played pickleball. I just wanted to give you a tour, guys, because sometimes people doesn't know what they're getting on uh, when they are in a clubhouse, right? Um, without someone showing in detail what you're getting. There is, oh, this is the tennis court, okay. So there is a tennis court here, guys. Oh, I love the Red Rock Mountain. I can see the red mountains there. The, those mountains, there are so red right now. It doesn't justify in the video, but when you go here in person, you'll be able to see the Red Rock Mountain. Beautiful color. Okay, now we're going to enter another section of this clubhouse. Hopefully you're still with me, guys. Comment down below if you're still watching. Because I wanted to show you what you're getting. Oh wow, this is really nice. Resident use only. Look at this guy. So that means it's all only yours. So you can invite your friends here and play tennis. I would definitely utilize this if I'm staying here. I'm going to use this a lot of times. Maybe like weekly. Because it's not only for fun. It's an exercise when you do tennis. It's not even just one, there are four. Wow. And then you have uh, some seating arrangement here and uh, access for your, uh, you know, if you wanted to take a bathroom or use the toilet, it's easily accessible here. Okay, why did they make this open? Now I can play tennis. Oh, this is a pickleball. Is this a pickleball? Oh no. Yeah, it is a tennis. Damn, I don't know anymore what's the difference between a pickleball and a tennis. But pickleball is becoming popular here in Las Vegas. There's another court there. What? There is a lot of court. <laughs> this court. This is like pampering everyone here. What do they think of people? They're going to play... Um, What are they thinking? That means they allocated a bunch of courts. They probably feel like there's a, a lot of people that are going to play tennis, right? Or so there's a lot of things to do here, guys. See how it's open there? It's open there. Okay. And those are the model homes, guys. So 
imagine once these are up for sale i'm gonna feature them again so feel free to subscribe down below so that once i feature the model home you will be able to uh see the uh the sales price right okay this is another area here where you can just relax because you have an unobstructed view of the mountains here this is gorgeous you know if you're just walking it's a large property that's why people are going to enjoy this view guys let me show it to you okay so this is your view there's a lot of mountains here in this area of Summerlin, and then the red rock mountain is there right it doesn't show in the on the video for some reason i think it's because of the lighting but this is amazing a lot of views here it's very quiet in here it's very peaceful you know it's it's something where you will appreciate once you're retiring or you just want a peaceful life right so nice and the weather right now is pretty good it's not too bad meaning it's still um, not hot okay and there's a view of the Las Vegas strip again here right so there's a lot of things that you can enjoy here you can walk here and then you can just invite your friends and say have a coffee somewhere and then just go back here play some uh, tennis it's gonna be a great life for you guys especially if you build your home with a view of like this right and this is a guard gated so therefore you're even protected wow this vegas strip the sun is like lighting it up okay hey guys so this is another footage for your uh, clubhouse so basically this actually opens at 5 a.m and it closes at 9 45 p.m you just have to purchase a, a key fab so that you can access it as early as 5 a.m and then it closes as night at 9 p.m the good thing also i've heard is that even if you're not uh, 55 so basically 20 20 um, percent can buy though can buy a home here even if they are not 55 so we'll just have to check if it's still uh, available right for you to purchase if you're still within the 20% home ownership here. Okay, that is just uh, an example, guys. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this bonus footage. Hello, everybody. This is the single story home, and it's quiet in here, right? This is uh, the view here. There's a lot of mountain views here. We featured that. Uh, Move in ready home with that huge RV parking. Check out Lenar playlist on my channel page and you'll be able to see the full video tour of that one. So this is your neighborhood here. I feel like the people sometimes bought their second homes so that they, jo they don't have to worry about their uh, hotels, right? If they ever have to visit the strip, they can just literally go here and have this as their second home but it's also good for residential because you have your community pool so watch the uh, bonus footage when i featured the community pool guys so imagine yourself right you have this kind of home it's a three-car garage right you have three-car garage there you have that entrance there's a there's a garage there with which leads to the casita so it's the casita has its own garage it feels so special and then this garage is your garage to the main living or the main house see how your stonework is side by side you have a very nice garage which has two uh, can lighting and then this one is your style now i wanted to point out guys when you're going out of your home you have this view of the mountain it doesn't justify the video but when you're here in person those mountains are gorgeous gorgeous so this is how it feels right this stonework here is so 
it just looks fantastic. Okay, so you have a separate gate leading to your courtyard with this elegant stonework, massive. It, this is a double protection here, right? So imagine, right, going inside and then you have this courtyard all to yourself. That is the entrance to the casita and this is the entrance to your main living house. Now, before we go there, I wanted you to, to appreciate this, guys, because this is something where some houses wouldn't have it, right? And then also, even when you're standing at your casita here, I'm sorry, your, um, your uh, courtyard, you have a view of the mountain there. It's so gorgeous. It just doesn't justify on the video. Okay, so now let's enter the home. This is a nice space here, guys. What I would suggest is if you put like a seating arrangement and then also some um, freestanding waterfall feature, this is going to be amazing because you can hear the water upon entering your home. Now this glass door here is an upgraded version and then it's double door. You're getting this. Luck, welcome to your beautiful home. This is huge. Okay, it's gonna take 30 minutes here, guys. Pardon me in advance. I hope you're gonna stay with me for a long time. Okay. First of all, I wanted to mention this are large plank of porcelain tile. This is not a wood. It's a porcelain floor tile that looks like a wood because of the grain. Now, a lot of people would choose this so that if they wanted, like, don't have to with water or scratches, then that is going to work for you. Now, in the B-roll, if you watch the B-rolls at the beginning of this video, we showed how it would look like if you have a furniture. So please check out the B-roll again. This area here is for those that wanted a receiving area. So basically, you will put your um, seating arrangement here so that once your guests, friends, or family members came, they can sit here, relax, enjoy some wine if they drink, right? Tequila mojito is my favorite, guys. So if we go to the bar, I'll be able to order a mojito. Okay, so that's, this is this area here. It's just a receiving area, but definitely you can do an office here if you want to, right? You can just put like glass door here and hola, you have a space for your office. This is bright and wide. Okay, so this is your Live, uh, main living room area here. That's your TV area. You can make this beautiful if you put like cabinetry underneath, floating cabinetry with LED lighting and also TV area there. Okay, that is your door leading to your backyard. This is your kitchen, the white bright kitchen. And then this is your area for your dining. It's just spacious. Okay, let's dig into this kitchen since we're already here. They're giving you this eight by five, eight feet by five feet long island. Plus, they've included an extra cabinetry. Sometimes they won't give you this front cabinetry, but how do you feel of this design, guys? It looks, it looks good. It also has its purpose for additional storage. Now this is your pantry, which is quite not large. See how this is the uh, flooring they've used. Yeah, this is the flooring they've used. It looks like a wood, but it's really a porcelain floor tile. It's called Azul Azulajo de Porcelana para Piso. Right? Okay. 
This is how it feels, guys, when you're standing at your pantry area. All right, okay. I forgot to mention, this is a 10 feet ceiling. I already measured it a while ago. It's about 10 feet. Okay, so they're giving you white cabinetry. Let's see if it's soft closing. No, it's not. I apologize, guys. You can just put the hardware later on if you want a soft closing. Now, this is one thing that they've included, a double door monogram refrigerator, right? Wow, this is nice. There's a lot of storage here, guys. This is a monogram, which is nice. Monogram is quite expensive. Now, if they put this here, because the one that I showed in the, in the one that is next door to the here, that I, when we were entering this house, didn't have this refrigerator. So if they put it here, most likely they'll put it there too. Now this one, you have crushed ice, sorry, Crash ice water, right? So you can have water dispenser there and just make sure you put the filter, the filter there and you have fresh water. Now they're giving you this door golden knob. Usually I see a different color of the knob, but they're giving you the golden knob. This is definitely vented, right? Yeah, it's vented. This is another monogram adventum okay the brand uh, meaning the it's monogram adventum this is an expensive appliance here even your oven and your stove is a monogram really nice okay and then this is how it feels when you're standing at your Island, you can watch TV there, right? Angelo Home Tours in 4K, YouTube videos. And then you can talk to the people that are enjoying your sumptuous meal. It's a very open floor plan. And then they're giving you this one, a merry sink and gooseneck faucet and your water tap, which, is, which can be filtered by connecting it here if you buy the filtration. And then they're giving you a monogram dishwasher. Looks fancy to me. Right? Wow, okay. So they are pampering you with monogram appliances here. I hope that the other video, meaning the house that uh, we featured will give you the monogram as well. It's the other house that uh, we toured a while. Uh, we, uh, when we were walking inside the house, you see the other house on the right side. We already have a full video of that one in your, in the channel page, Lenar playlist. Okay, now we're gonna go to the secondary bedroom first before we go to the primary. The good thing about this configuration, guys, is your secondary bedroom is here, and then your primary bedroom is there, and then your casita is all the way there. Okay, so let's begin to the primary, but before that, this is your coat closet. Okay, that is your laundry area. We will check that in a while. So this is the Secondary bedroom. It's actually decent size. This is probably 11 by 11. It's not too big, but it's also not too wide. And then this is your standard closet here. They're giving you a recessed lighting, but you can also put your own nightstand. Okay, now this is your bathroom. Hello guys, which is used by the um, Secondary bedroom, they've always consistently used this water sense which saves water. And then they are giving you this white, beautiful quartz with this sink and chrome faucet. Now this one, there's a line here. We will have them check it and remove that or clean it once we do the walkthrough. 
I forgot to mention they're giving you blinds all over this house guys so you don't have to worry about it they've also consistently used the uh, flooring here which is nice okay so this is this looks like a standard shower area to me okay that is your full bathroom which can also be accessed by the people that are in this area right because I don't see a uh, half bathroom on this side. So basically they'll have to use that bathroom too. This one is your air filtration system. And it's easily accessible. You just have to open this. You can replace the water filter easily. I'm sorry, water filter. You can uh, easily... Um, open this and then also uh, change your uh, air filter not water filter since we're already here on this side let's go to your laundry now this is an upgraded version guys because they've given you this quartz counter with this um, cabinetry right you can put all of your um, detergents there and then they're giving you a dishwasher and a laundry machine. Wow, okay. So you don't have to worry. You just really have to bring your toothbrush and toothpaste. And you're ready to live the life of a Las Vegas local. Wow, I wasn't expecting this. Because the other home that we toured, the one that I mentioned a while ago where we were about to enter the home, they didn't have this so most likely if they put it here they're gonna put it on the other house okay so that's amazing this is your Wi-Fi system there that uh, is ready to go you just need to hire a Wi-Fi company okay this is the entrance to the garage it's a two-car garage very tall ceiling okay so now we're the only thing is it's a tank water right but if you don't need the tankless, definitely this still works. So this is how it feels guys. When you're going, when you're about to go out of your home, you will be greeted by this amazing mountain views. Right? This mountain is gorgeous. It just doesn't justify again. Okay. So this is how it feels, guys. This is your neighborhood there. Lots of mountains. Very quiet. The one that you're hearing are the construction workers, right? Is they're still finishing some houses here. Okay, so imagine yourself going back home with your Tesla McLaren. Rolls Royce, Lamborghini, right? And also Kia. Or if you don't have a car, definitely use this as your storage. If you have a car, then definitely use it, guys, because it's going to be hot in here in the fabulous Las Vegas. This is the Rainbird, which usually is a scheduled system to water your plants. Because here in Las Vegas, it is not allowed to water your plants every day. There is just a schedule. So make sure you follow it because they penalize the homeowners that doesn't follow the schedule. Okay. Now this is how it feels when you enter your home. So there is one suggestion I wanted to make, guys. Because you have a space here, if you don't need this space, you can probably put like a, a seating arrangement here with a a shoe rack underneath and then a coat hanging item there so that you can re easily put your shoes there and then put on your slippers and then you go back home and then you enter the main living area put your clothes there so it's a very efficient that's the second bedroom secondary bedroom we saw a while ago okay so this is how it feels when you enter your home so now we're ready to enter your primary bedroom. So we're going to do the casita the last. 
there is a coat closet here. Okay, so now this is a wide entrance to your primary bathroom. This is wide. They have given you they are they have given you a an upgraded tiling. This is a huge sink here. Hello guys. And then this looks like semi upgraded with quartz but the floor tile pan is not it's looks standard to me they've given you that window there so that it brings so much narrow light inside there's another sink here so for example you are single you have all of this to yourself right but if you're a couple then definitely one is for you and one is for your significant other which the ladies might take this over versus that because this is longer they can put their makeup i don't know who will take the most but it's up to you guys to decide i don't want them to decide for you guys <laughs> i'm just giving an example everything you hear on this video is just an example everyone is welcome to buy there is no exclusion you are all welcome regardless of your gender right okay so this one is your water closet which is quite bigger than usual so you can close it so that it wouldn't smell right and then this one is your closet now this is not the biggest i've seen so far because i've seen much larger closet you know huge house like this but this is nice because you have already a space for your shoes now i don't know if for example you're a couple then you will have to share this now i don't know where will be the ladies here or it, will it be just the ladies closet and then the gentleman will have a space here i'm not sure I'm just trying to explain things that I heard from personal experience of touring couples. But if you are a single, definitely this is all yours. So that's just my example, guys. Because sometimes I tour single people or I tour couples or with children, or without children. Everyone is welcome to buy this home. I would really appreciate to um, assist you no matter what your status in life is now this is your primary bedroom this is quite spacious definitely a king size bed will fit in here with large nightstand there this doesn't justify in the video guys as i said this is a wide angle that's why you can't feel it right now the true uh, space the good thing is you have access to your backyard from your bedroom area right this is nice so that when you wake up in the morning and then you want to immediately access the backyard because you wanted some fresh air then that's perfect okay now we're gonna go to the casita area before we go to the backyard so that is the door we entered right this is your main living area the casita is all the way here now you can black this for example you don't want your guests or private or special people friends family members or if you're fighting with your significant other if you are a couple let's say and you don't want to see each other then definitely this is a space to separate you guys <laughs> i've heard that a lot of times when there's a casita <laughs> they are joking me like their significant other is going to get the casita and the other one is going to get the primary bedroom that is just an example if you are uh if you have a significant other but if you're single definitely you can enjoy this as well right so if you are going to rent this most likely We'll have to ask permission from the HOA because sometimes they don't allow rental 
especially if it's an Airbnb, because the HOA doesn't allow those in most communities. But if it's a long-term one, it's easier to get a rental permit. Okay, so this is the casita here. It has its own entrance, right? Double entrance there. That is the garage. And then this is the courtyard entrance for this casita. Now imagine, guys, if you have this for your special guests, family members, they'll feel special about this. You have a dining area section there, living area, living room area here. And then you have a refrigerator. Wow, you're pampering whoever is going to stay here. Imagine they don't have to go inside the house. They can drink here, get water, right? And then they also have a space to put their food. They have the sink here with gooseneck and they have a microwave to cook, to uh, heat their frozen food. It just doesn't vent, right? Because the vent is on this, at the top of the microwave. Okay, so it's not allowed to put a stove in a casita because you would require a separate permit. But in this community, most likely they don't permit that kind of uh, stove in the casita. Let's go on this side so you can feel how it is to enter the casita from the courtyard. Okay, so this is the courtyard we went to a while ago. That is the main door to the living room, main house. That is the courtyard. So when you're, the person that is staying here likes to enter from the courtyard, this is how it feels, right? And then the good thing about this is They've used this flooring all throughout. They didn't even use a different flooring here. That's amazing. Now, why this casita is special? It's because they have their own bedroom here. Right? This is spacious, guys. It's probably 10 by 11. And then they've given you the triple door. Wow, okay. So this is really special. So if you have, for example, you have a parent, you wanted them to be with you, to stay with you, because maybe they wanted to be with their grandchildren. This could be the perfect place for them because they have their own bedroom. They have their own bathroom, which we will check out. Hello guys, so they can enjoy this sink, this quartz, this chrome, this shower, right? This is just standard to me, that kind of a wall surround. So definitely they'll be able to stay with you, live with you, enjoy their grandkids. Now I'm just telling this as an example guys, but if you're single of course, you will also enjoy this. I'm just doing it as an example if you have parents, right? But if you don't have parents, that's okay. Because sometimes, you know, you don't anymore have parents. And definitely you can have your friends here. So I'm just giving an example. Okay, so this one, see how they have their own laundry? They don't even have to go in the main living area to access the laundry. Right? Okay, this is nice. Now... This is one of the most important aspects. If the person staying here has a car, then this is special because they have access to this garage. Now, this garage doesn't look like a garage because of those windows. It doesn't feel like a garage. I feel like it's another bedroom or living room or a room because of those windows, so much natural light going inside this. Now, what I would suggest, if you don't need this kind of garage, I will convert this into a gym. Because you have the ability to have fresh air by opening this window, right? Yeah, you can convert this into a workout area so that you will be healthier.
Okay, so I wanted you to feel, guys, how it is from this side of the garage. When you enter the garage there and then go to your casita, right? So you will park here. This is nice. This stonework is magnificent. Okay, so you park here, right? It's so special. And then you're going to enter the casita. Right? Okay. So you enter this casita. Oops, sorry about the noise. You enter this casita, you put your clothes there. Right? And then you use the bathroom here that we saw a while ago. And then if you wanted to rest, you can put your, you can rest in your bedroom there and then holla, you have your main living area. Wow. This is very ideal for those who needs the casita. It's so private, you can even close this. Now if you want your guest or whoever stays here on your casita, if they, you want them to access the main living area, this is how it feels. And then we're going to check the backyard. It's already 30 minutes long, guys, but I apologize because I wanted to detail this because this is a move-in ready. This is how much you would see in your move-in ready. Now, the beauty about this is you have an extra access here from the dining area. This is a covered patio. It's very private. No one sees you here except for the people there, but I don't think they're gonna even see you because it's too far already. Now, this is what I wanted to show, guys. When you're seated here with your seating arrangement, that is the primary bedroom that we saw a while ago. You see how there is a view of the mountain there. So you only see the roof of your neighbor. A little bit on the window there, but not much. Okay. This is not a pool-size home. So the reason why I believe they put this together as this kind of lot is because the community pool is there. So I think most people probably won't. I don't know. They probably think that people wouldn't put their own pool. That's why they didn't put this as a pool-size you can probably put like a small spa here. But this is the model home, guys. It's going to be for sales in the future. So if you wanted to buy that in the future, please subscribe now so you can see it when I feature it again in the channel. But if you wanted to see the model homes, all of these model homes are in my channel page, Lenar. So see how you have mountain views here. That is the clubhouse. And this is the mountain view. Okay. So now we're going to go on that side, right? The only issue, if you are standing here, right? I want it to be transparent. When you're standing here, you can see your neighbor. But if you're standing there in that area, you don't see them, right? Especially if you're inside. Okay, so that's how it feels. Another section here, right? Very, this is the wider section also. Okay, lots of mountain views here. Okay. Wow, it's, it's a nice air here because you're so elevated. It's much fresher. Okay. And then this is how it feels when you enter your home from your courtyard. I mean, from your porch. Again, guys, thank you so much for all of your support to the channel. This channel is really growing super fast. I think it's because of your support. Even if I do good videos, but if you don't support it, definitely this channel will not grow. I always want to improve each day, guys. So anything, any feedback, please comment down below, especially the house, because I wanted to know, is this worth to you, the price? And also, is this something like that would work for you? 
I wanted to understand what your needs are so that I can help you in your home search. So if you comment, I'll be able to know. But don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video to the people you might know might be interested in this kind of home with a casita. And also don't forget to contact me if you ever decide to tour this home or other homes in my channel page. And also, even if you don't see the homes on my channel page or my YouTube channel, if you saw it from another YouTuber, definitely if you didn't sign an exclusive agency contract with them and you don't have any agent yet, I would be happy to assist you. I appreciate your help to the channel again, guys. And I really wish you an amazing and wonderful day today.